Hey, what's up guys, Wookie Light here, and today I'll be uh, telling you about the uh, movement mechanics in Pit People. So, first up is the Vampire. And usually, here you can see it can move three spaces, but if you hold A, it allows you to get two bonus spaces by flying. So, by holding A, you can like bypass spikes and hazards on the floor as your Vampire walks over there. It also allows you to go further so you can pick off weak targets easier. Up next is the Spidar. So what you do is you can move a character on top of a spider, and then if it's a person, a cupcake, or a mascot, it can mount the spider and ride it around. The spider usually can move three spaces, but if it's mounted, it can then only move two. But the person on top is protected by like most attacks. For the gnome, most characters can move onto its space and then be launched. I think anyone with a weight of one or less spots can be launched, so I think that means Gorgons, Hair Trolls, and um, Troll Moms, and Cyclopses cannot be launched, but everyone else can be. Um, the launching is very inaccurate, so take that into mind when you launch it. The limitations of this is that when you are mounting or being launched by a Spider or a Gnome, the Gnome and the Spider cannot move on that turn, so it's sort of a wasted turn for them. If a character is mounted on the spider, it cannot be launched by a gnome on the same turn it gets off, it has to wait a turn. You can utilize these abilities to get easier victories in the pit against other players who don't know about these mechanics. Don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe for more pit people content.